Woods, buddy, and got a little unboxing video today. That's that's right. Uh, do a little unboxing here. It's uh, it's fun. <laughs> Check it out. All right, we got the box here. We got the little cut down camera up here, and uh, as always. Moving some things around here. Got our trusty knife. And our office right here, our desk. Now, oh, a little bit of dust here. Nah, nah, not nice. You know, my little we'll top of my dust is dusty. We'll move this a little forward a little bit. Let's see, have a little bit more look here. There you go. All right, and we got everything here. Right, it looks like I could get a new keyboard. I got a couple of worn out uh, buttons here. <laughs> got our trusty knife, as always. And you can't tell. Look at look out here. You can't tell this is a lithium ion battery. So, of course, they have the sticker on the side. All right, the, the side was broken on this side a little bit, so all right, open that, cut that a little easier. And this is from our friends at Amazon. So, oh, this box. Wow, they. Ah, there we go. So. You got to see what it is. It is the DJI Mini 3 uh, drone. Yes, that's right. It is a drone video, basically. And I got, I love this. It has, it's, it's shrink wrapped, so it's nicely protected. I, I, I like when stuff is shrink wrapped. Just looking to see where it opens and opens. There's actually a seal here. You guys can see that. Ah, oh, there you go. There's a seal right here. So we're going to just take our knife. Get in there. All right. Cut the plastic. I take that plastic off. Now I got the three versus the four. A little bit less expensive. Um, I'm not a full-time drone person. It's my first drone. But I wanted something with a separate screen. I saw a lot of the, the drones have to use your phone or something like that to connect for video. And I'm like, yeah, I'd much rather have one with a remote with the in the remote have the screen built into it so need to cut the seal which you guys see right here the light's a little bright we're gonna do this there we go move the light a little bit above me and to pull tab ah and you can see how nice it is. It actually has a little plastic here to hold, uh, not plastic, but paper, uh, cardboard to hold the drone. And it drones right on top. Wow, that is really nice and small. Put that down right here. And then underneath. Uh, it's always hard when you're <laughs> doing this away from yourself. Uh, hole in the center. This is uh, this is cardboard material with like a plastic coating on the outside, but this is cardboard. Feel that. And then I have the remote. And then I have, there's nothing else in there other than packs. And this box here, 
So I'm going to take this, put this on the side. And I hear my little doggy yelling at someone. Maybe another Amazon delivery. You never know. <laughs> oh, wow. There is uh, little bits of... Uh, oh, put that knife away. Safety first. And this is all sealed. If you guys see here, this is all nicely sealed. There's actually adhesive on this. I'm just taking this. And you guys can see this is the remote. And I have to read the owner's manual. There's some parts back here. Uh, I've seen some with the antennas on top. This looks like the antennas are built in. I see where there's broadcast for antennas up here. Oh, this is... Ah, now I see. For the... Ah, look at that. Right in the back back here, you could store your joysticks. I'm going to go ahead and put them on here. Because, you know, why not? I'm eventually going to get a box, um, a case for this to protect it, to make sure. And then let's get the drone out itself. This is really, really compact, really nice and small. Uh, it has a cover for the camera and the gimbal. Oh, look okay. at And you can see... All of the protective plastic on there. And wow, this is really, really cool. Wow. Well, I want to read the owner's manual how to open this up. I don't want to break anything, but I can see you see in there, you actually see the motors. Um, for those uh, those little motors right there for the propellers. So yeah, a little little baby helo here, and in the back is USB slot, as well as the SD card slot. I have additional SD cards as a wedding DJ. You do have SD cards. Uh, power button on off. It also tells you where the battery is at. The battery life. And the battery, I think on this is, I would have to take a look, but should be removable. So, uh, ultralight, 249 grams. I, I, you know, I know the rest of the world does, you know, grams. Here in the United States, we do ounces. So I could tell you right now that feeling this, very, very, very light. Um, you know, you're talking probably maybe, I don't know, maybe a quarter pound, half pound. Uh, it is not much in weight. I mean, it's like, it's not much. If I had to compare something to it, this weighs much more than this. This probably, this probably weighs twice as much, if not more than this. And that, that says a lot on the technology in a way. It's mostly the battery and the little motors. And those little motors, I keep looking at those little motors in there. And again, you see the copper. So I know there's a little maintenance and stuff like that. You do it. Uh, replaceable blades you can get. Uh, there's a bunch of stuff you can order for these. And I'm going to be ordering things for this unit. And one of the things that, you know, with these, uh, the screws right here, one of the things I read is double check and make sure your screws are always nice and tight before flight. But I'm going to be taking off the top here, charging this up, checking the screws, uh, and then going through everything and then doing some test footage on this uh, for myself. But I'm kind of excited. I'm very excited. On the remote itself, again, I put the two joysticks on there. 
Uh, you have a few controls in there, including your power button. Uh, you have some buttons in the front here. Uh, one for camera. Uh, I think it's stop, start, record. This is picture. Um, I have to read where everything is, but it's kind of like laid out. Like if you're if you if you do it Xbox or a PS uh, system, is kind of similar to that way stuff is. It feels kind of similar to an Xbox. Uh, there's trigger buttons down here. Oh yeah, there's trigger buttons down here. So there's trigger buttons here. There's buttons here and in here. So you have your hand and a couple of places. Uh, USB. Let's get USB C for charging. Which is there, and there is a uh, micro SD slot there, which I think there's a micro SD card slot here too. There is micro SD slot here, so maybe you got two micro SD cards, but one here, one there. I have to read more about it and see what it says, but. I like how the camera just picks up all the little pieces of lint that pick up from this. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, this is uh, this is pretty nice. Um, I don't like it. I gotta get this charged up and so forth, so on. So yeah, I'm gonna be uh, charging this up, playing with it, and uh, get some drone footage. Hopefully today, if not today, Sunday. As I happen to have uh, a wedding tomorrow, and that's why I got to concentrate on. I got to do some stuff for that, but that can be a little bit later. Um, I can have a little fun now. Oh, in the box. I forgot, almost forgot. I'm sure you guys want to see what's in the box. What's in the box? What's in the box? Tell me what's in the box. You don't get the reference. Then you do watch some good movies then. Google it. Okay, so there is... A, some different additional propellers that comes with it. That's nice. Some additional screws with those propellers. Really nice. But again, two more propellers. So at least one corner. You want your helo working, but you do want to get extras. I read every single person I ever read. They said make sure you have extras. Uh, screwdriver comes with it for the propellers, and a USB-C to USB-C plug for charging, but I have to have tons of USB-C stuff because I run Android and I have USB-C on everything. Um, and, of course, stuff you got to want to read, including a DJ store. Let's see here. There's a D DJI store right here. There's a an app and stuff like that. Um, it's in Chinese. Uh, Virtual Flight, DJ Academy, DJ I Academy. See, I'm so used to being a DJ. I see DJ. It was just DJ. DJ I Academy, Managed Devices, DJ I Forum, Special Support, and DJ I Care Refresh. Probably extended warranty. Um, they also have editing software, which I have my own editing software, so I don't need that. Uh, uh, let's see here. Japanese, Japan flight safety rules, Australian flight, uh, flight safety rules, DJI warranty information. Uh, let's see here. Uh, safety guidelines. Uh, so there's an owner's manual, quick start guide. So make sure you read that. One thing also, um, any this is this is for personal use. This is just for me to fly around the neighborhood and look at cool things and do some cool stuff. Uh, but if I decide to do it commercially, do it for my business, do it for whatever, then I need to go apply for an FAA license to be a drone operator. And I know two people who are now drone operators or FAA licensed. Um they said it's not difficult, but you do have to take a test. You do have to go through stuff, pay some fees. Uh, if I decide to start doing that for my business, I can easily uh, go into that and start doing that and start applying for it and go through the process. If I decide to do that and go through the process, um, 
you know, I'm sure there's plenty of tutorials here on YouTube, but also uh, I go also talk to my friends who are certified. And it's one of the things that, uh, I, again, I'm looking to have some fun with it, fly around the neighborhood, fly around. I just had a tree trimmed in front of my house, go up there around the outside of the tree, look down and stuff like Cool stuff like that. That's why I geek out on. <laughs> Maybe take some drone footage of my uh, my vehicles, you know, something like that, do some cool uh, 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 video of that kind of stuff. So it, it's, it's, it's a lot of things that uh, gives a lot of opportunity, a lot of options. So, but if you are watching this and you're on YouTube, do me a favor, smash a like button, give it a thumbs up, make sure you subscribe to the channel. And if you're a DJ and we've actually talked about drones on my show, the DJ round table, I host that. Uh, and you can watch other episodes. I'm sure it'll pop up around here somewhere on the, the tubes. Um, but I do a, a show about uh, for DJs, about DJs, everything DJ related. And one of those things we talked about, we actually talked about a couple times already, are drones. So if you're into drones and you want to learn more about the DJ world and a lot of things to make the DJ life better, if you are a DJ and you want to do a drone, we got video up there about stuff, talk about drones. But it's one of the subjects we also could add to our next episode because now I have a drone and I have two DJs that also have do drones and both of them are certified. Um, it'll be interesting conversations coming up soon. So <laughs> I want to thank you, first thing first, for checking out the channel. Second thing, I want to thank you for watching the video. You know, it, it's, it's always great. And have a blessed day. Other than that, again, remember, smash the like button, follow the channel. Hit the bell icon. Make sure that it's all there. Other than that, please make sure that uh, be kind to someone. Take someone and do something nice for them. You know, be it uh, buy them a buy them a cup of coffee at Starbucks. You're in line at a drive through with prices being outrageous. You know, the person behind you, and you're at Starbucks and they're, they're getting a, a, a coffee. Hey, how much the person behind me a coffee? Oh, it's eight dollars. Hey, you know what? I'll buy someone a cup of coffee today. Do something nice like that. You know, pay it forward. And, you know, hopefully they'll do the same thing to the person behind them. You never know. But uh, little things like that makes the world much better, makes people happier. And, again, share the fun, share the love, and enjoy yourself. Other than that, guys, I'll see you guys later. Have fun. And we'll be back here again with another unboxing sometime soon.